guys, I know the title isn't clickbait. It's real. I really am giving up on sneakers. <laughs> Good night, welcome back to the channel. That will probably be the last time I call you guys that. Unfortunately, yes, it is true. I am giving up on sneakers. Now, before you click off, let me explain exactly what's going on. So basically what's going on is I am transitioning a moment in my life where sneakers were a thing of the past. I started that when I was a freshman in college. And when you're a freshman, you're pretty much straight out of high school. Like you still got like a younger mentality. I'm turning 22 in less than a month and just things have changed in life. Unfortunately, that is what it has become. I recently got into the College of Entrepreneurship, which if you guys know my journey of college, initially I went to a community college, which I did my two years there, got my AA, just to get into my dream school, which is Florida State, reason I got this tattered on my arm. And then I started doing mechanical engineering here at FSU. However, I wasn't enjoying that, so I had to switch. Like I took a whole semester off because I wasn't able to start in the spring for entrepreneurship in regards to the fact that I had to get some prereqs done. So I took that whole spring of last year off and then in the fall that just recently passed, so the fall of 2018, I took the prereqs and also in the summer of 2018, I took one class just to get all my prereqs done, just to potentially get into the College of Entrepreneurship. So in January, I applied, I sent my application in, I sent all the other additional information that they asked for. I showed them that I had two YouTube channels with over 30,000 subscribers on each one of them. And I'll also show them that I own a business, which if you guys don't know, it's my clothing line, New Religion. So I sent all that in and it took about a month or two for them to get back to me. I ended up getting in about two, three weeks ago, which was really good. Like, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I didn't wanna get in because I knew if I didn't get in, I know I would have all the other time aside from working at the barbershop to dedicate to YouTube. However, the case was that I got in, which is like really good. Like that's, it's not easy because only a hundred people got in out of all the people that applied. So when I got that, I was part happy, part devastated. And I know it's not good for me to say that, but the only reason I'm saying this is because now when I went to the meeting, of like pretty much the initiation meeting where you gotta go and then sign a paper saying that you're gonna be in it. Like you definitely like are now part of the Jim Moran Entrepreneurship School. I realized that those people that were in that room with me, I'm gonna be working with them for the next two years. And networking goes a long way. And there's more I wanna do than to just cut hair, than to just do YouTube, than to just have a clothing line. Like I wanna be a serial entrepreneur. That's the reason I joined the program. I joined it to have not only the network of the people that are gonna be there because everybody there has the same mentality as me, hopefully. I know some people are in there just to BS and get through school, but the majority of people that I got in, I'm sure the people that read the applications and the essays, they read through all the bullshit. I'm sure that the majority of the people in that program are there to have a really bright future and I can almost bet that the majority of them already have something going on for them. So that's a big opportunity for me to have those people and then also the classes that I'm gonna be learning. I know a lot of people say school is BS, School is BS for entrepreneurship, but I love to learn. I hate to read though. I really do hate to read. I'm more of a person that learns from visually or somebody explaining it to me. So when I go to class, I really do absorb the information that I get. It's really valuable information. Like I'm not, obviously not gonna remember everything, but I remember the most important things, especially from the great professors. So you guys are probably asking, what does this have to do with sneakers? This is just an advancement in my life. Like I wanna transition this channel from a sneaker channel to an entrepreneurship channel. Not solely entrepreneurship, but pretty much giving you guys more value to your life, not just sneakers. Sneakers is only a part of it. I wanna help each and one of my viewers advance in life. And I feel like this is the perfect moment to do that because as I go through this entrepreneurship program of school for the next two years, I will be learning and I will be educating you guys for free. Literally, you guys don't have to go to school for this. I will be educating you guys on what I learned. So you guys don't have to pay the thousand dollars in tuition for the next four or five years of your life. And I'm not gonna strictly make videos on the classes that I'm learning. You guys just kinda have to understand and grab some things from my videos the same way I go to school and grab some information from what the professors are teaching me. And I really do apologize for you guys are here that are just for sneakers and fashion. I honestly never saw myself doing this, but as you grow, things change. And this is pretty much gonna be a new chapter in my life. I've been wanting to make this video for a while. I just didn't know how to make it the perfect video to transition my channel from our sneakers to the next channel, which if you guys have any recommendations on channel names, please shoot them down below in the comments. I'm really still like trying to search for the perfect name. I, I don't know, I really don't know what to make it. I really need your guys' help. Like 
you guys are my viewers. I know some of you guys are very loyal to me. Like, I know you guys will stick to me through whatever happens to this channel. And I know some of you guys will leave. I really can't satisfy everybody, but I'm trying to satisfy those, even those people that are resellers. You guys are entrepreneurs, but you guys just don't know it. You guys basically have your own business. You guys buy for low and sell high. Obviously it has high demand, so you can probably even sell for higher depending on what it is you're selling. So this channel, regardless of where it goes, it's going to benefit you guys. It's up to you guys if you guys want to unsubscribe. I'm not going to force you guys to do anything. I want my viewers and subscribers to be genuine to what my content is going to be about. And like I said, for those of you guys that are here for just sneakers, I apologize. I really do. But I really do appreciate the support you guys have given me through the years. It has really helped me drive through everything. Like I don't think you viewers understand how much you guys mean to a YouTuber because you guys are the only reason... YouTubers exist. If it wasn't for you guys, obviously YouTube overall would not exist. Once again, thank you to those that have supported me for the past three years. It really was fun and it was a heck of a ride. It was definitely a learning experience for me and I do not regret a single moment from it. Anyways, now our sneakers is officially a thing of the past. Make sure you guys keep grinding. I'll see you guys on the other side.